What's up guys? In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing 50 of the best free iOS 13 jailbreak. You guys love the last video I did and I'm super excited to get into this one. If you enjoyed today's tweaks, let me know by smashing that like button and subscribe. I'm being a little ambitious, but let's shoot for 5,000 likes on this video. All of the tweaks talked about in today's video will be down below in the description as well as all of their repos. All right guys, let's get started. Shortcut Enabler is a tweak that enables the flashlight and camera shortcut from iPhone X style devices on older devices. Great way to get this functionality. Say you have an iPhone X style device and you want the exact opposite of that. Invisible shortcuts can help you out. Smarter LPM will also let you fully customize your low power experience on iOS. Pencil Charging Indicator allows you to have an Apple Pencil style charging interface. CC Music Artwork allows you to view the cover art of any song that's playing in your control center. If you miss the iOS 6 style lock screen, you can get that back with 6LS. With Notivibe, if you press in the side button, you can make your phone vibrate with important notifications. Cowbell shows you your iPhone's battery percentage in the control center view for low power mode. Swipe for more allows you to install, uninstall, and queue packages in Cydia with ease. With this tweak, by swiping on either side of the screen, you can toggle the control center or also lock your device. Cool folder makes your folders look pretty cool. You can also make your folders look different with UFold as well. As if you didn't have enough folder tweaks to try, you can also give Folded a try as well. Airdrop Confirm allows you to confirm an airdrop before you send it to someone. LS Tweak allows you to customize your lock screen. It's been a few years, but Activator is finally updated for the latest devices running iOS 13. Activator allows you to set up custom actions. There's so much that you can do with this tweak. Anything I say now won't even touch the surface of it, but it's a great tweak. Try it out. With this tweak, if you swipe over to the right of the screen, you can easily launch some of your favorite applications. Hidebar 10 completely eliminates the home bar on iPhone 10 style devices. Exact time tells you the exact time when you received a notification. Prediction shortcuts replaces the prediction bar in iOS with cut, copy, and paste. Bottom toolbar light changes the style of your control center. If you sent a message by accident, send delay gives you enough time to cancel it. With this tweak, you can have both the date and the time in the status bar. Instead of just letting you delete letter by letter, delete cut lets you delete entire words at a time. Instead of having to worry about tapping on a pop-up box, you can tap anywhere and it'll dismiss it. Longer call button gives you a longer call button. Pill volume gives you circular volume and brightness controls. Menu support replaces the cut, copy, and paste words with icons instead. Let me know lets you know when you've connected to an active call with haptic feedback. Artemis, amongst other things, allows you to clean up your lock screen and make it look pretty clean. In this example, the Face ID lock is completely gone. I also have a custom carrier as well. No DND banner eliminates that annoying banner that comes up when you enter Do Not Disturb mode. With DND My Recording, if you start recording, Do Not Disturb will automatically be enabled. This tweak randomly rotates all of your icons on your springboard. This tweak gives you up or down arrows in the settings page to make navigating it easier. Dotto Plus replaces the typical notification badge with a circular icon. With Dawn, you can mix and match different elements of light mode and dark mode. You can see dark mode's enabled, but I have both light mode and dark mode elements on my phone at the same time. If you ever wanted a way to bulk delete alarms in the clock application, this tweak can help you out. With the current situation going on right now, you might be kind of bored. That's where fortune cookie comes in. You just shake your device and it gives you a fortune. This tweak gives you stylized text for notifications that makes it look like it came right out of Pokemon. This tweak is another cool notifications tweak that makes your notifications look sort of leaf styled. Dock spring is the most elegant way to respring your device. Just pull up from the dock and there you go. This is a theming engine that you can install on your device and you can toggle between themes pretty quickly. Want to clean up your passcode view? This tweak can help. Right now I have the letters hidden and it looks a lot cleaner. Wonder Bar lets you color your status bar. Weather Ground is a really cool tweak that not only lets you tap on your status bar to see what the temperature is, it also gives you sort of a live wallpaper as well. You can see I have clouds as my wallpaper. 
If the notch on iPhone 10 style devices ever really bothered you, you can now finally get rid of that on iOS 13 with a tweak called Egg Notch. You can also change the color if you want to, but I would just stick with black. If you want to count down a specific date with counted, all you have to do is set your date and then tap on your clock on the lock screen and you can see the countdown going. Authentication successful. Speak notification speaks your notifications. It's pretty cool and I didn't have notifications when I was recording this, but it also records system actions such as authenticating your device, authentication successful, or the battery as well. Battery, 44%. This tweak is a light version of a tweak that adds a secondary dock for any of your applications. The light one specifically only works for music and it's really cool, but if you wanna have the same tweak but with no limitations, then you can go pick up the paid version for $199. With vinyl, you can change the way that your now playing interface looks and interacts. For example, this bar up top is to change the volume. Another awesome tweak that's been around forever is Icon Renamer. While in wiggle mode, just tap on whatever app you wanna rename and let's get Give it a name i'll just say subscribe with a smiley face and you can see that that name is applied color my home lets you change the color of your home bar since i have a red iphone i think the red looks pretty cool all right guys that pretty much wraps up today's video if you did enjoy it please let me know by hitting that like button also go ahead and subscribe and turn that post notification bell on so that way you never miss out on an upload when this video goes live i also will be launching my patreon so if you want to support the channel on all the future content so that way i can get better equipment and make better content for you guys consider subscribing on patreon the link for that will be down below in the description let me know what you think of this video of course by giving it a like and telling me what your favorite tweak was down below in the comments section thank you guys so much for watching have a good one guys peace